Right, so let me show you how to do this, this update and also clearing your network settings. So what you need to do is find the settings icon on your phone. So we're going to hit, that's mine, that's the icon there. So we're going to hit that. Now in your menu there, if you look down the menu, you should see an option for general. Okay, mine's there. Alright, so select that. And in there you should see a menu option for software update. So hit software update and it will go off and check. Now mine's already up, upgraded to 702 but what yours may say is that there's a software update available which will be the 702 update. So hit the button to install that. It's not very big, it should only take a couple of minutes. Then when it's done, have a look and see if it's um, improved the crashing. If it hasn't, then what we can do is try and reset the network settings. So what I'll do is the next bit of the video, I'll show you how to do that. Right, so let's have a look at resetting your network settings, assuming that um, it's still crashing. So again, you need to pop into your settings menu. There we go. Again, we're going to find the general option. So move down. There you go. It's general. And right down the bottom of the general menu is a menu option marked reset, which is there. Okay. So I'm going to hit reset. Now you need to be a little bit careful in this menu because if you hit the wrong thing you'll wipe everything on your phone and we don't want to do that. Um, what you want to do is look down the list and one of them should be reset network settings. Okay, so what you don't want to hit is reset all settings or erase all contents and settings. But the one you want is reset network settings. So select that. Now it'll ask for your PIN number. So I'm just going to swipe away. So enter your PIN number and then it will ask that you want to confirm that you want to reset your network settings. So if you hit the red option at the bottom, there we go. What will happen is your phone will restart um, and it will reset all your network configuration from your provider and also your Wi-Fi. So bear in mind, um, if you've got any Wi-Fi networks, you'll need to re-enter the password for those. Um, but hopefully if you do that it tends to sort out a lot of the crashing issues that I've seen reported on some of the dev forums. So, so give that a go. Um, let me know if you're still stuck and I'll, um, I'll see if I can help you some more.